This is Twit. Vulnerabilities in the massively widely used curl command and library are always a concern since the library is so often included inside other projects because the the, the features and services that that curl offer are you know are incredibly handy so it is significant when daniel stenberg who is the curl project's lead developer calls one of two just discovered vulnerabilities quote probably the worst curl security flaw in a long time unquote and that's saying a lot by the way <laughs> oh boy yes it is uh, the two flaws, which were found by JFrog, impact libcurl versions 7.69.0, which is where they first appeared, through 8.3. Daniel wrote, quote, We're cutting the release cycle short and will release curl 8.4 on October 11th including fixes for a severity high CVE and one severity low. The one rated high is probably the worst curl security flaw in a long time. The new version and details about the two CVEs will be published around 600 UTC on the release day. So there was CVE 2023, 38545, that was the severity high, which affects both Lib curl and the curl tool, which is built from the Lib, and also 38546, who's, which has low severity and affects Lib curl only, not also the tool. Uh, he said there is no API nor ABI change in the upcoming curl release. He said, I cannot disclose any information about which version range is affected, as that would help identify the problem area with a very high accuracy. So I cannot do that ahead of time. He said the, quote, last several years, unquote, of curl versions are as specific as I can get. In other words, the last several years of curl have had these problems, one which he characterizes as the worst curl security flaw in a long time, meaning that, and this is the significant part, anything built with those libraries, anything that incorporated any curl within the last few years is also potentially at risk, and thus the severity of this overall. He said, we've notified the distro's mailing list allowing the member distributions to prepare patches. Now you know plan accordingly, unquote. So the worst of the two problems sounds quite bad and is easy to exploit on its face, but fortunately, its required preconditions will prevent the world as we know it from ending. The curl maintainers wrote in their follow-up advisory, they said, quote, the flaw is a heap-based buffer overflow in the SOX 5 proxy handshake when curl is asked to pass along the host name to the Sox 5 proxy to allow that to resolve the address instead of it getting done by curl itself the maximum length the host name can be is 255 bytes if the host name is detected to be longer than 255 bytes curl switches to local name resolution and instead passes the resolved address to the proxy. Due to this bug, the local variable that means let the host resolve the name could get the wrong value during a slow SOX5 handshake, and contrary to the intention, copy the too long host name to the target buffer instead of copying just the resolved address there. Okay? Unquote. So we have a timing based race condition that could lead to remote code execution via a buffer overrun. The curl dev said 
that the overflow could be triggered by a malicious HTTPS server performing a redirect to a specially crafted URL. The JFrog, the JFrog guys who found the problem said, quote, seeing that curl is a ubiquitous project, it can be assumed with high confidence that this vulnerability will get exploited in the wild for remote code execution with more sophisticated exploits being developed. However, the set of preconditions needed for a machine to be vulnerable is more restrictive than initially believed, unquote. So, this feels exactly like another one of those vulnerabilities that, while it doesn't explode the Internet, will be latent. It will be entered into those massive exploit databases I've theorized about in the past. Something like that must be maintained by our NSA and unfortunately by all other sufficiently sophisticated malign actors on the global stage. There's likely a huge dependency tree that knows which version ranges of every utility and library that uses curl was built using any of those vulnerable curl libraries during the years that, that, that curl it was now known to have been vulnerable. So whether it's next year or 10 years from now, when we or some hostile actor, you know, some hostile foreign power wishes to penetrate a network, that database might serve to remind such an actor, you know, that, like for example, hey, you know, the set of circumstances you're facing just happened to perfectly fit the use of a long ago patched but still present in the target system flaw that we can take advantage of today. You know, as I've often observed, given the Swiss cheese that is our industry's legacy of interdependent flawed libraries, which continue to persist because they're embedded in other things that are still being used, you know, you know, and in, in this environment of slow moving updates, there's just no way that, a, that such a, uh, a capability does not exist. And it's a little creepy because that's a lot of information. So you could just imagine that would be a perfect place to apply AI. Some AI has ingested all of the, of the past history of vulnerabilities and interdependences so that you, you aim it at a given scenario where you want to, to, to penetrate and it looks and finds a way in based on the, 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 the current versions of the things that are detectable and knowing everything about uh, still vulnerable interactions among them. So, you know, <laughs> we may be uh, entering, <clears throat> excuse me, a whole next generation of, of, of ways of penetrating networks. Tech Break is brought to you by our friends at IT Pro TV, now called ACI Learning. Invest in your current workforce and fortify your business's future. Your whole team will love to be entertained while they train. Visit go.acilearning.com slash twit. Twit listeners can receive up to 65% off an IT Pro Enterprise Solution Plan after completing their form. Based on your team size, you'll receive a properly quoted discount tailored to your needs.